Hey guys, it's Mallory, and we are doing some tourney practice for round three of the uh, free-for-all tournament. Um, I posted this, and it filled up in two seconds with a bunch of grandmasters. <laughs> so let's see how this goes. Um, I've played this once or twice so far. It's been going pretty horribly for me. Not gonna lie. I'm also first. Oh, no. Orange is mad at me. I don't know what he wants from me, though. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. Orange is a uh, cool Tim. Um, 121 on the leaderboard. Super good player. He won two tournaments recently. I think he... Was it the Grandmasters tournament? Um, I think it was. He... Uh, won the uh, the Rivertown Invitational, which was a fun tournament, and then the very next day won the Grand Masters tournament. We also have uh, Purple Spud, um, host of the Risk Legends tournament, 23 on the leaderboard, crazy stats. Uh, Black is Soul, um, top 500 Grand Master. I've played Soul a few times. He's also very good. And then um, white is Innocent Kitten, who I don't think I've played yet. Top 1,000 Grandmaster. Um, I really am a big fan of, of kittens. Um, Pete had her on Waiting on Your Best Behavior. And um, sorry, I just got a ping. Did I mess this up? I did. Crap. I, I, I made this progressive. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this is going to be a really fast game, bud. <laughs> Whoops. Spud is streaming. <laughs> hey, guys. Um, sorry I messed this up. I'm a dummy. I, thought, I forgot it was fixed. Oh, crap. I should have checked the settings. Honestly, I was wishfully thinking because I really hate thick zombies. Dang, that's a big stack. Oh, but yeah, so uh, Pete had Kitten on Waiting on Your Best Behavior, and it was like honestly my favorite episode. She's just like a really like cool person. I'm getting tore up by these zombies. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. I'm sorry, Tim. I'm sorry. Um, well, this will still be good practice, and it won't last as long, I guess. When I played this this weekend, the blizzard was here, too. The rest of these blizzards are a little bit not... This one is a little bit consequential, but the rest really aren't. This one is, too, I guess. Somebody could really hold this whole back end... With, with one. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, soul got infected. 32. Oh, no. Goodbye to all these. I hate those happy noises so much. Oh. That sucks. That is so frustrating. What a mess. This is just a mess from beginning to end. I really need to practice this. It's funny because I practiced the Troy map like probably 20 times because I actually really loved that map and loved those settings. I practiced Pirate's Bay like twice and I think I've practiced this twice now. Like I just can't stand these settings at all. <laughs> And I'm not, I'm just like 0% Im impressed with these settings. I hate fog. Zombies are okay, I guess, if I could tell what was going on. Um, but yeah, it's just, it was kind of cracking me up because I probably did play, I'm going to say at least 10, if not more of those Troy games and... These last two, I'm just like, whatever, man. I do not care. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I'm just going to die, I think. I'm just like a complete goner over here. And Spud actually protected himself, so he was actually smart. Hope for the best, I guess. Oh, what a nightmare. Can't believe I messed that up. See, I only practiced this one other time, though. I forgot that it was fixed. And now I can't see anything that's going on. Oh, Spud traded. Huh. He still had... I think he's got this back here. I wonder why he traded. That was interesting. Huh. Thought I was the only one who traded early around these parts. What's happening? 46. I mean, that's better than it was last time. I think I'm still okay. Okay. 
My two teeny tiny little stacks. I wonder if I should have card skipped, since this is progressive. Tim traded early, what the heck? Oh, I wish I knew what was happening. Mercia. In Georgia. So if you are playing zombies, you can tell with this little green plus two where zombies are. So that means Georgia and Mercia. Oh, shit. Hey. Georgia, Georgia. Mercia. Mercia is here, so that might be Spud. Georgia, is it over here somewhere? Here it is. Somebody's right here. That was Tim, the last I knew. Oh, there's little card icons. Oh, my God. That would have made it a lot easier, huh? Oh, and Kitten traded, too. What the heck? Were people getting that weak? Let's see who's down there. Tim. Okay, so now I think Spud has this whole thing. I think he's like the only person getting anything. Don't do it. I hate, I think I hate zombies because it just really feels like everybody's hiding and especially in the fog, you have no freaking idea what's going on. I do have a trade, so that's nice. I got that going for me at least. Okay, it's almost like everybody can see Tim. Ah. 
keeps fist bumping. Okay, so now Tim is getting a plus nine. Does he have this? Oh, crap. That's not good. I need to skedaddle away from here, I think. I wonder what that was all about. This is also why I hate fog. I'm so nosy. I just want to know what's happening. I'll move. Man! That was so rude. Okay, so I definitely need to trade this next time. That is for dang sure. I am freaking dead if any of these people find me right now. Guess I'll just hang out here. This is the biggest territory on the map, so I feel like that means I'm doing a really good job. Because look at how much pink there is on this map. It's a lot of pink. Tim only got three troops that time. So he must have lost this. So I've got 12. He's got this whole thing now. I think I need to try and hide somewhere. Oh my god, this is so boring. Twelve. 
Oh, whoops. Whoopsie. Oh my god, I'm like absolutely cornered right now. <laughs> Do I have a trade? No. Unfortunate. Thirteen. I wonder where a kitten's at. Um, I feel like Tim is probably going to kill me right now. Good game. I just want to see where everyone's at. We can keep watching this one. Oh, I don't. I forgot to turn that screen back on.
Ooh, kitten is like almost done for. Sorry, I'm just uh, in Spud's Twitch thanking them for, for playing, um, even though I messed up the settings. Kitten, you got a trade on four? Oh, she doesn't. Oh, what a bummer. I swear, zombies are just like, I mean, once you know how they work, like, they, they will only attack if they have twice as much. So, like, if they have a two and you have a one, they will use their two to attack your one. It won't always work. So, they always have to have twice as much. So, like, Kitten's 12 here is actually pretty safe um, because th the zombies are going to need to have, like, at least a 24 before they will attack her. So now this is really down to Spud and Tim. Yeah, this can all be like a two point hold here. He can pop his 11 out. Oh, kittens down here too. Oh, I didn't see that. He's he's protecting the kill on her. Oh, so interesting. She's hiding down there. Okay, where is he going to fortify to? He's going back. So this is the only place Kitten is now. She definitely has a trade now. She's busting out. I don't, I don't know about that. Oops. Oh, 
And then when the zombies hit, they convert anything that they killed into a zombie. Ooh, that was smart. This was really smart. Oh, Spud, you're so good at this game. This was genius. Him doing that. Killed Kitten for the three cards. He'll get to trade again. He's got a pretty tight hold on his stuff. He's got this one hidden down here, which I think is smart. Um, he's, he's thinking Spud might not be able to find him. I'm betting. And then this was really smart for Spud down here. How do you know? How do you know he was down here? Oh, it worked! Oh, it worked! Wow. So now he's kind of like encasing the zombies so that they can't break in anywhere. Ran out of time, but that's okay. He might even get them this very next turn. Wow, good game. Yeah. Ooh, and he had a trade on three. Good for you, Tim. He's got to try and finish him off quickly, though, because they could infect him, which means essentially busting in any anywhere. Sometimes it can be good to give the zombies a few territories to hit. I don't know if that's scientific, but that's how I always feel. Like, get, give them a couple of... You gonna finish this? Oh god, he's almost out of time.
You got this. You can do this. Yeah, I was about to say that tent is not big enough, but he got it. You got it this time? Oh no. Oh, what a nightmare. They're getting in everywhere. Yeah, you can't mess around with the zombies. They get they get mad. It's like the only thing that's gonna stop them is running out of time, basically. Oh, goodness. You got to trade at least. You gotta hit that 70 stack. It's just gonna cause you all kinds of grief. Oh, he ran out of time. At least these hundreds were locked. That was smart. If you did that on purpose, Tim, that was very smart. Because now all the zombies have are these teeny tiny stacks. Except for that 40. Pretty good. Ooh, yikes. going yeah he's got this he moves quick he's got it right now 
wonder if he's playing on mobile. Faster, buddy, faster! Can they get in? Yeah. Ooh, that was so lucky. Oh, that was so awesome. Okay. He's got him right now. For the tournament, zombies do not count as a bounty, but they do count for placement, meaning if, y if it's just you and the zombies that are left, you have to kill the zombies if you want first place. You do not get bounty points for them, though. All right, this was a great game. Very well played. Um, not fixed, though. The tournament is fixed. Do not make the mistake I made and make it progressive. But progressive zombies are just more fun. <laughs> so um, thanks to Spud, um, Tim, Soul, Kitten, and... Me, Spud, Tim, Soul, Kitten. That's everyone. Five people. It was really great playing with you guys. And we will catch you next time.